So what's up fam, back at it again, it's 2017, new year. So I was gonna post this video like early in the year or maybe like late December. But I'm like nah, nah, let me not do that to them. Cause like, you know, January is like the one month free trial of the year. So, since it's February now, it's about time I do this video and post it up for you guys so you know what's real. Anyways, you're about to find out if you're ready for 2017. Or not. Nah. So, you ain't ready for 2017 if you're still trying to force relationships. I mean, like, come on, nigga. It's 2017. Whether it be a friendship, an actual, like, dating relationship, or whatever. If you gotta force it, man, it ain't worth it. Ladies, if you're still chasing around guys with cars, you ain't ready for 2017. Like, stick to your bus ticket. You're gonna need it. If you still get touched or like caught up in your feelings or something when someone doesn't write on your Facebook wall when it's your birthday <laughs> You ain't ready for 2017 man But happy birthday though if I don't say it If you still begging for followers on Instagram, Twitter or whatever where people follow each other You ain't ready for 2017 man Like Those people probably aren't gonna follow you back I mean like if they really wanted to the minute you followed and they checked out your profile and whatnot, they probably would have followed back. So stop begging for follow backs, okay? If you don't have any goals or targets or something that you want to achieve by the end of the year, you're not ready for 2017. I mean, like, it doesn't have to be something big like, whoa, I'm gonna take over the world or whatever, but like something that makes you a better person. If you don't have that, you ain't ready. If you still get touched or all up in your feelings or you still care what people think about you especially if it's those people who have no effect in your life who do not pay your bills who do not put food in your mouth nigga you weren't even ready for 2016 to start with so let's not even get to 2017 like mm. now I know a lot of people might disagree with what I'm about to say next but it's the truth y'all if you only pray when you're in trouble or when things are going awful in your life you really ain't ready for 2017. Like, seriously not ready. But, hey, I'm just saying. It's up to you what you do, but... If you're going at it with someone that really means a lot to you, that you really like, whether it be a friend, someone you're dating, or family member, and you guys don't want to talk about your issues and come to a mutual standpoint where you both agree on something, you're not ready for 2017 because like ain't nobody got time for that it just shows you're childish if you're gonna be going through some shit with somebody that you really do care about and then you know they care about you as well if you're just gonna block them on social media or whatever instead of talking it out like normal people I mean like what were you gonna do if you didn't have social media avoid them for the rest of your life you're just running it for yourself because you're going to be in hiding the whole time. And they're probably not going to care. They're just going to be like, okay, I'm going to live my life. Either we talk about this and get to a point where we're like, okay, we're cool now. Or we're like, okay, we don't fuck with each other anymore. So it's up to you. But if you're going to go and block somebody on social media, like, that's just weak as fuck, man. I'm sorry. Uh, This one's for, I guess it applies both ways, male and female. If you still posting up... Mm, inappropriate pictures on social media just to increase the number of likes you have or followers you ain't ready for 2017 I mean like if you're gonna post the nude that's on you everybody's gonna enjoy looking at it but if you're gonna feel your nude or you are worth something by the amount of likes that picture has or by, or by the amount of followers you gain from posting that picture ciao you ain't ready for 2017 at all. Well, that's all the points I could come up with. If you could come up with something, comment below. Let me know what it is you feel someone's not ready for 2017 if they still do this or they still feel this. Or you can hit me up on Twitter at Sammy D. Souza. And until next time, booyah!